Here, the question is: Given the following program fragment, this is the fragment. What is the minimum number of test cases needed to achieve 100% statement coverage? And then these options are provided. Now let's analyze the code and draw a flowchart to get the answer. The first line is if day equals to Monday. Since it is a condition, we have to represent it like this on flowchart. If condition on line one is true, line two, then statement A will execute. Since it is a statement, we can represent it like this. If the condition on line number one fails, else part will execute. That means line number four, statement B, will execute. Since it is a statement, we can represent it like this. The fifth line is end if. This end if is for condition on line number one. And this is how we have to represent it on the flowchart. The sixth line is day equals to Tuesday. Since it is a condition, we have to represent it like this on flowchart. If condition on line 6 is true, line 7, then statement C will execute. Since it is a statement, we can represent it like this. The eighth line is end if. The end if is for condition on line number 6. And this is how we have to represent it on flowchart. With this, the flowchart is complete. Now let's analyze the flowchart to get the answer. As per the question, we have to find statement coverage. Since the statement are present in two different branches, we need two test cases to cover 100% statement coverage. Therefore, option B, 2, is the answer.